First off, the casting number, which is obviously the identifier of what heads you have, is always going to be right here on the corner of the cylinder head on both sets of heads. Obviously, these are 706s. Uh, I'm in the process of taking these apart right now to get them sent out to Texas Speed. But that's the first tip you should know. There's also a marking right down in here. It starts with a 1. Uh, kind of delete the one and read the 706 and that's also an identifier for these cylinder heads as well. Another tip with these 706 heads is these are a 61cc chamber. Now for most people following along they already know what that means. This is your chamber size and that's a 61cc. Now 706 heads are a 200cc intake port and from the factory they call them uh, small valve heads. They're a 189 and 155 valve. A lot of people use these for uh, higher compression builds. I think they were 9.5 nine to 1. I'm having these ones ported and having a 200 valve put in. And the 155 valve is going to say stock. They're going to do a 5 angle valve job on these. Now with this build, I'm getting rid of the factory rocker arms. You don't have to though. Uh, these are friction fit, meaning the uh, trunnions in here are kind of held on by friction. A good upgrade uh, for these is a trunnion upgrade which gives you a little bit stronger of a center shaft right here. And it also has a C-clip that holds this in. These, fa these factory uh, rockers still handle quite a bit of power. There's a lot of builds out there that'll hand that are a thousand horsepower plus. Uh, it's just not the way I want to go with this. Another great thing about these heads is they're plentiful. Uh, 99 and up, 4, 8, and 5, threes. There's hundreds of thousands of them out there. So they're a really good uh, junkyard head. And they flow really well right out of the box. And obviously, if you have them ported like I'm going to, it's just going to be that much more. All right, guys, this has just been a kind of quick tip for all you beginners out there, as well as myself. I uh, hope you enjoy.